Why does my pet shake his head? So head shaking, head pawing, um, but head shaking is Flappy usually ears. a sign <laughs> of ear inflammation. Um, and ear inflammation um, usually happens from allergies, um, and that's something that we see very commonly in, in our area. But what will happen secondary to that is they'll get an infection secondary to the inflammation, and that's important to understand. So the infection that we're looking at, it's usually yeast or bacteria. These are normal flora, normal inhabitants of the pet's They're ear. They're supposed to be there. There's just way too many of them because of, because of the inflammation. That, that's there. So usually they're trying to make it feel better by, by shaking their head. Yeah. Um, it's important that you get them in and get this treated because what can happen, particularly animals that have long ears, uh, is that from that flapping, from that shaking, they can bust little blood vessels in their ears and their ears actually swell from the that. Flap, um, the flap swells. So it is important that uh, we get it uh, feeling better and under control so that they're not head shaking and ultimately so that uh, we're preserving their ear canals as well. Yeah, and something really neat that when we see a patient that has an ear infection, we see lots of debris or swelling or you know pain, we actually take a Q-tip, swab the ear, and then smear it on a microscope. Uh, slide and then we stain it with specific stains and we look at it. Is this pet having an overgrowth of that yeast or of the bacteria or a combination? Because the worst thing in the, in the world is when someone's like, oh, my pet gets an ear infection every few weeks and I use this flush and it gets better. But are they using the right therapy? Is their dog always getting a yeast infection and they're using something that's really not going to treat what's going on? So getting so, to the root of the problem. Yeah, diagnose and then we can approve the or pick the right treatment.